What's up guys, Adrian Amaral with 911 Gadgets. In today's video, I'm gonna open up some new tools. Some of them are gonna be on our website. Some of them are just something that we use on an everyday basis. And some of them are gonna be included in the cell phone repair starter toolkit. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I can't wait to open these in particular. I need to start opening these sandwich boards. But um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you like, subscribe. And if you have any questions regarding the tools, go ahead and leave a comment down below and and visit us on our website at 911gadgets.com. Hope you enjoy. Okay, so like I was saying, I'm excited to open these right here. This is the Mijing, Mijing, somebody pronounce it. My Jing, Mi Jing. This is the sandwich openers. Uh, they're preheaters. They're the sandwich board openers. So this is for iPhone X, XS, XS Max. Then we have the one for 11 right here. And then we have the 11 Pro and the 11 Pro Max right here. So the heater, the preheater will have a, like different adapters to it. So this is what it looks like. Here it is, right there. And Let's go ahead and open it together. There it is. That's what it's gonna look like on the inside. There's a couple of barcodes in here that you can scan them, I'm guessing. So let's take these out. So now we've got five of these. All right, now these, you can buy them separately. Uh, you can buy the, sta the station, this right here. This is the heater, the actual station and these are the adapters okay so these are the adapters this is the heater so let's go ahead and open up the heater first I I can do this and I got a little buddy right here hanging out with me right there can you see him oh he's gone no he's there there he is ha <laughs> he's hanging out he wants to be YouTube famous oh see you later bro so annoying I'm gonna get him when I get a chance but all right here we go here goes the heater let's go ahead and open this up this is the actual base station all right so what it says right there that's the one piece right here we're gonna go ahead and open the iPhone 11 Pro and 11 Pro Max this is what it looks like dang there you go Ta -da. and then you would put it up here if you want or you can just set it aside there's a connector that goes there I'm guessing it's the lighter box I was wondering what this lighter box was all about so let's open this lighter box it has your power cable and everything here is the power all right so it's plugged in and there it is so I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in as well Plug this into here, as long as it's plugged in. But I mean, if you want to, you can secure it. I don't feel like doing that every time I switch um, bases or whatever. Now this one here, we can. We can just tighten this one up since this one's gonna stay there forever. Okay, so here you go. I'm gonna turn it on. And that's uh. I'm gonna feel if it's getting hot. How high does it go? 200 degrees. I've read you should have it like at 180 or something. So this center part for sure is hot right there. That's really hot. And then you get this part right here. That one's kind of hot, but not as not as hot. So I'm going to unplug this one. And we're just gonna compare the different the different ones. Ah! <laughs> Super hot. I thought it would be cooling off a little bit, but I guess not. All right. So that's for the 11 Pro and 11 Pro Max, all right? So then we have the one for the iPhone 11. Here you have them. Let's get the one for the iPhone X, XS, and XS Max. 
something that really burned me, guys. All right, here you go. Those are the three different motherboards it can handle. So, yeah, this is a very essential tool if you want to do micro soldering on the newer models. Now, you don't need these, absolutely, but it will make your life easier to have these. Now, if you've been doing it for a long time, you can probably get away with the cheaper ones that are like 30 bucks, 40 bucks. One of the guys in our group is the one who mentioned the cheaper ones, and he can just do it because he's been doing it for a long time. He's a professional. That's all he does, right? He fixes boards. Uh, shout out to Sean Tyson. So those are these. That's, that's these tools here. I'm going to put these away for now. All right guys, so this is our, this is the mat that's found in our cell phone repair starter toolkit. I'm gonna take, get rid of these screwdrivers real quick so I can show you the mat. This is a heat resistant mat. Okay, it has some, uh, some little cubbies here where you can put stuff in and you can just close. It's heat resistant. It can withstand a lot of heat. Silicone is flexible. It has some areas that are, that have magnets and it'll say there, it'll say magnet on here. So there's a magnet here, there's a magnet right here, there's a magnet right here, and there's a magnet up here too. So this is really cool. Really helps if you want to start using your heat gun on top of stuff, you won't burn your tables and stuff like that. And then we got this one that comes with it as well. It's a magnet magnetized or magnetic mat. So this one will hold your screws. Um, for example, I got a little screw right here, so I'm going to just put it right here. It'll just hold it for you guys so you can uh, lay them in, a, in your own ways in your grid so you don't lose the orientation of, of the way the screws go back onto the phones. So we have that and we got these awesome screwdrivers guys. So how many of you guys have to be looking at your tips and see which one's which? So these, they're, they're almost like a fidget spinner. See it has spins. So we've got these right here, and we got this little screwdriver right here too. Where are you? <laughs> ah, he's the, the coolest screwdriver. Right, Zane? Tell him, tell him your name is Screwdriver. Screwdriver. There you go. Hold it. Yeah. Tell him, tell him, buy this one. Buy this. It's the best one. Best one. Buy now. Buy now. <laughs> Okay, say bye. Bye. <laughs> Let me kiss. Okay, go over there. I'll go get you in a little bit, okay? Yeah. Okay, so as I was saying, they have the, they're lasered on there. So it has like the Star, the Convex, the Phillips, and the Tri, or the Mercedes, or the, what else do we call it? The Y. These are really good screwdrivers. The tips are awesome. They're magnetic, so you can pick up screws with them. And... I mean, I can't, I can't stress how good these are. They feel really good and good quality. They're built with aerospace aluminum. But yeah, so that comes with the toolkit. This comes with the toolkit. This comes with the toolkit. Uh, we have a bunch of stuff that comes with the toolkit. We got the special picks. Now, sometimes uh, people might think like 99 bucks. <laughs> I mean. It seems expensive, but it's not. You're you're really getting stuff that I handpicked myself over the years. So for example, this pick right here, I'm throwing one of these picks in there. This is what I use for the Samsung back glass, and I use it for other fragile repairs, but mainly for that Samsung back glass. There's a bunch of them, S6, S7, S8, S9, S10. So I use this and have videos of me using this. So I'm putting a bunch of stuff together that I use every single day. I'm not just making this up. I use this one, look how beat up it is, all right? I also throw in a 58 millimeter plastic pick. It's not as thin, but you need these for certain repairs. So this is a thicker one that I also use it. Look how beat up it is as well. Okay, so this is what I use on my everyday. I use a brush to brush off. If I'm gonna clean water damage with alcohol, I brush this off. Or if I'm gonna clean whatever I gotta clean, I, I use this, so I'm throwing one of these in there. I'm also using tweezers, okay? These straight tweezers, I'm throwing these, these are ESD safe. You use them every single day. Look how beat up they are as well. See that? So I got tweezers. I did a live video um, removing the iPhone X battery. I use this. People say it's metal, like it's okay, but I, I, I like how it's 
it's big like that so I'm able to get in, be in, the, in the battery and not puncture it because of how wide it is. I just barely lift it a little bit and this is what I use for batteries, Samsung, Apple, anything I need it's right here. Um, you can also use it for other stuff for, to pry other things but this is uh, what I'm throwing in as well. This is the 911 gadgets version. So got that and then I'm also throwing in it's right here. So this right here, I'm gonna throw that in there as well. What this does is, there you go. Let's plug this in, and there you are. Oops, wrong one. So right now it's reading the amps. It's A for amps, so that's 95 and, and V. That looks like a U, but it's V for volts. And I have an XS Max right here that we're gonna just plug in just for fun. And it does work with uh, Android as well, guys. So here is five volts. This thing is turning on 0.92 amps, 0.82. Let's see once it turns on, let's see where, where it takes us. So it's charging, you see, it's pulling the amps that it needs to. Let's go ahead and plug in a Android charger. Here's an Android charger right here. And let's plug in the, um, where's my phone? Hmm, guys, I'm always misplacing my phone. Okay, so here's my phone. Let's plug it in. Charging. There you go, 0.96 amps. Let me move it to a different port and see. See if it could charge a little bit faster. What's they're they're pulling 96, 0.96. Maybe it's this thing. Uh, but the thing is this will read exactly how many amps, how many voltages you're pulling, okay? Along with the toolkit, you also get one of these plastic spudger tools. I use these for hard to reach areas where I need plastic, not metal, and I go in there with this, either with the flat part, with the wider part, or with the pointy part, okay? As you can see, it's pretty beat up. It's also one of my daily drivers, so. We got a bunch of tools here for you guys. Um, check out the, the cell phone repair starter toolkit on our website, 911gadgets.com, and you can visit the tools section. This is what I use every single day. Oh yeah, we get that, the razor blades, of course. I'm gonna throw that in there. Yes, you guys can buy everything yourselves, go in and load up on everything, but this is the, the, the starter kit. So if you're just starting out, this is what you need. This is it right here. If you're not starting out and you just want a few things, go ahead and message me. I do have the, the screwdriver kit. I have them together and I have them also individually listed. Here's that blade. And I also have these awesome clamps. I use them for like iPads or phones when I'm putting a back glass together. Probably gonna use it for this bad boy right here. It's an iPhone 11 that came in. So you put the glass and you just tie it away. There you go. Okay, so this is also gonna be a really hot seller. It's not included in the kit, but I might just include one in there for those of you who buy the kit. We'll see and see how many people inquire about it. So yeah, there you go, guys. This is this is what I wanted to show you today. I do have another cool another cool gadget that I'm not sure if I'm posting on the website yet. Let me know in the comments if you want me to sell it. And that gadget is this right here. It's a wireless smart USB display charger, so check it out. All right, so I plugged it in, and this one actually, you know how we talked about the ammeter and stuff like that? This one actually has that already built in. But, uh, see the focus? There you go, guys. So see, it's reading 5.2 volts at 1.2 amps. So this one's charging better than my other charger that we used earlier. You can tell um, this is a better charger. The other one's probably just worn out. I've used it for years already, which is uh, why I started looking into other stuff. So here you go. So it shows all of them. You see, they're all zero because there's nothing else plugged into them. You can charge simultaneously. Um, I'm gonna plug in an iPhone real quick. So here we have those two. You see that 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, 0 0.9. There you go, 1.3. And that's more like it. That's actually charging, you know, not like the other one. It was still charging at 0 0.90, but come on, like this is already at 2.2 .2 amps. So definitely a better charger, and it does read um, the amps that it's drawing. 
okay? And I'm gonna go ahead and place a phone on top. You guys can see what it looks like. So we're charging two devices right now through cable and I'm gonna place one on top and there you see, you see there in the middle, it shows that it's charging. You see the little dot with the lines on top and bottom? That's because I'm charging this phone. You can see the Apple logo right there, but uh, I'm gonna remove it and there you go. It's it's gone, it's not charging anymore. You see that? I turned on this uh, XS Max. So here we go guys, I still got those two plugged in. I'll show you guys the uh, that wireless charging. See? It's charging up at that corner, you can see it. Simply by laying it on top of it. All right, so that was a really cool gadget that I really wanted to show you guys. I'm not sure if I'm gonna sell it. I'm still testing it. So, so far so good though. So yeah, I'll try to leave the links in the description and I hope this video wasn't too long. Um, I'm definitely excited to use these. Got some phones I wanna work on that have just been sitting there. <clears throat> so yeah, if you guys have any questions, leave me a comment down below. Please like, subscribe, and share. If you guys want to learn how to open your own cell phone repair shop, go to 911gadgets.com forward slash cell phone repair training. Download the curriculum. You guys will not regret it. Check out our video on YouTube, the one that says how to use our Facebook group. It'll show you a glimpse of what we talk about in the group, how you can learn more. And it's really, dude, for 40 bucks, that's, I get so many people telling me that just the group alone is worth it. And not only that, the sources and the unlock sources and all that, the just, just go, just go. Even if you if you're a professional already, let's network, let's grow together, let's help each other out. And this is the beginning of something huge, guys. So be part of it. I want you guys to be part of it. If we get together, we will grow and we'll be bigger than than what you imagine. But yeah, we're getting big already, and we have big plans for 911 gadgets, big plans for you guys and for everybody in our group. I wish you the best, and we'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out. And sorry, we can't forget to show some love to Cutting Edge, I believe is who sent us this. Here we go, we got some mugs. Let's check these out. 91 Gadgets. There it is. Yeah, Cutting Edge. Here you go, guys. Hit them up right there. Cutting Edge 772 area code 2602227. Cutting Edge PSL at gmail.com. Thank you.